coming. I am Andrea Harrington. I'm the District Attorney for Berkshire County. Uh, I am joined by uh, my first assistant, Karen Bell, Deputy District Attorney Richard Tahoney, uh, Detective Lieutenant Colbert uh, from the State Police Detective Unit assigned to the District Attorney's Office, Sergeant Mason from the State Police Detective Unit, along with Sergeant Jones from the State Police Detective Unit. I uh, thank you all for coming today. I'm going to make a brief statement. We'll take a few questions afterwards, although please understand that this is an ongoing investigation and we will be limited in the kind of information that we can provide to you here today. Uh, first, I would like to uh, extend my condolences to the Karpinski and the Wilbur families, uh, the victims from the incident yesterday morning in Sheffield. Uh, five individuals, including three young children, died Wednesday morning in a home that burned at 1343 Home Road in Sheffield. Among the deceased were Luke Karpinski and his wife, Justine Wilbur, both 41, who lived in the home with their three-year-old and seven-year-old twins. We are investigating this matter as a murder-suicide. At this time, the evidence indicates that Luke Karpinski was the assailant. Uh, this is a comprehensive and ongoing investigation. Members of the State Police Detective Unit um, assigned to the District Attorney's Office and the Office of the State Fire Marshal um, are still combing through the scene and searching for evidence. The scene is secure and there is no reason to believe that the public is endangered at this time. Yesterday, authorities transported the bodies from the uh, home to Boston so that the office of the chief medical examiner could perform autopsies. The causes of death are not available at this time. Uh, just before 8 a.m. on Wednesday, state and local police and fire departments responded to service calls for a structure fire at 1343 Home Road. An initial search of the residence revealed the presence of one deceased individual four deceased individuals were later found. Also responding to the fire on Wednesday was the Massachusetts State Police Crime Scene Services Section, the forensic scientists assigned to the Massachusetts State Police Crime Laboratory, the Massachusetts State Police Collision Analysis and Reconstruction Section, Sheffield and Great Barrington Police and Fire Department crews from Sheffield, Great Barrington, Monterey, Egremont, Richmond, New Marlboro, Canaan, Connecticut, in Norfolk, Connecticut. Uh, we can take a few questions at this time. Who was found individually um, that was by themselves and then who were the four that were to the side? Um, well, I can tell you that um, we, the, the mother was found individually and the four other individuals were found um, upstairs. Do you believe they were dead before the fire started? This is an ongoing investigation. We cannot provide those details at this time. Is there anything that it's an ongoing investigation. Unfortunately, we cannot provide those details at this time. Can, can you tell, tell us about the, uh, the weapons? We cannot provide that information at this time. What did the husband do for a living? Um, you know, our understanding uh, is that he was an attorney. Okay, thank you all very much. We will provide information uh, as soon as we're able to. Thank you. Thanks a lot, guys. I got press release here if you need one. Okay. Thank you very much. Oh, you're welcome.